In 2021, the bidding for the UK City of Culture 2025 began. The title held by Derry, Hull and Coventry brings with it the potential for long-lasting benefits to those who receive it. The Department for Digital, Culture, Media and Sport, upon the beginning of the bidding process, outlined what the hopeful regions and cities would need to demonstrate in their bid for the title. Applicants needed to articulate a vision, drive growth, innovate, reach out across the United Kingdom and globally, maximise the social benefits of investing in culture, maximise the legacy and have the capacity to deliver and embed environmental sustainability into their bids. Firstly, to determine who could apply for the title, an expert advisory panel assessed all of the 20 places that had expressed interest and then produced a long list of recommendations for the Secretary of State for the department. During the application process, this was Nadine Doris, and soon after the long list was published, it included Armour and City, Banbridge and Cravehaven, Bradford, Cornwall, County Durham, Derby, Southampton, and the Stirling and Wrexham Borough. Upon the announcement, bodies responsible for their bids were awarded £40,000 from the department to continue the development of their bids for the award, justified by the financial constraints of the COVID-19 pandemic across the country. With the financial aid in hand, all eight of the longest candidates got to work preparing their broader proposals for the UK City of Culture title, ready for the February 2nd deadline. Bradford's bid was and still is being delivered by the Bradford Culture Company. This entity manages the bid proposal as well as the delivery of the title if successful. In Bradford, the Culture Company was supported at varying levels by major companies Morrison's, City Fiverr, Arup, and several others. By the 2nd of February, the Bradford Culture Company had produced their bid and sent it to the department so that it could be compared with the seven competing longlist candidates for the title. This comparison was conducted by an independent panel of judges who analysed each bid against the criteria set out during the bidding process. In March, the shortlist was revealed to the public as decided by the judges. Bradford, County Durham, Southampton and Wrexham County Borough were the finalists. The panel of judges visited each of the shortlisted areas in the summer and visited Bradford in early May. During their visit, they were shown the National Media Museum, Bradford Central Mosque, Lister Mills, the Hindu Cultural Centre, Carla Sangham, Creative Keefley, The Unit, the New Bradford Market and exhibitions in Salts Mill. Along their journey, they were accompanied by local leaders, politicians and creators as they toured the region's cultural offerings and resume to win the title. Following this final assessment, the decision was made and announced on the 31st of May on BBC One in Coventry. In Bradford this evening, they got the news they wanted to hear. The UK City of Culture 2025 is Bradford. Bradford was the UK City of Culture 2025 and preparations immediately began.